her on in, uh, one of my favorite people uh, in ufology. And and uh, uh, God, Linda, how are you? Well, Ty, thank you for having me on. Two words that I completely 100% support, total disclosure. Absolutely. That our place in this universe and on this planet and relationship to other intelligences that are definitely, definitely real and that it is the oddest thing in 2023. After 44 years of my trying to get to the bottom of the truth of this complex phenomena is to realize that since World War II, 80 some years ago, the government of the United States learned in the battles with Hitler and all in World War II, they learned that the so-called Foo Fighters, mm. the so-called glowing orbs, all of it, they began to realize, my God, this is advanced technology from some other civilization that is not homo sapien. And when you realize that is the true boundary of the gigantic UFO phenomena, and it is 80 some years in which our government took the position that it had to hide the truth because as uh, Churchill apparently had a discussion with uh, Dwight D. Eisenhower as a general during World War uh, II that made it to the National Archives in the UK. They actually had a discussion together about the UFOs and ETs, Eisenhower and Churchill. Standing a few feet away from Churchill was one of his security people. The security people, the person ended up uh, marrying and having a child who today is a very, very, very famous scientist inside of the UK. That scientist is the source of the story that I'm now going to tell you. The, it was his father was doing security with Churchill. Eisenhower and Churchill are having a meeting in London. The year it's been discussed, but I think it was 1943. The United States did not enter World War II until December 7th, 1941 with the attack on Pearl Harbor. Mm. So this would have been perhaps a year and a half later that Eisenhower, our general and Churchill are having a meeting in London and the listener, the eyes and the ears to this are what became the father of a man who is a scientist in the UK. And here is what he reported in a national archive. They are discussing a report from an American uh, plane that had been flying in Germany and that the American reported that something that was glowing about the size of a grapefruit came up and started doing this around the tail, the fuselage of their plane, up, up to the wings, and a control. Like oscillating around 